people watching still. Heck yeah. Don't you that's, guys need to sleep? That's 500 people that are going to hate me by the end of the night. But. <laughs> All right, no, 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 no. They love you, man. All right, here we go. All Nitro, right. Mr. ConCon, Con, Losers Finals. Thursday morning fights. Let's make it happen. Hopefully, Mr. ConCon has got a different plan this time. Yeah, oh, I, I, are they button checking or is this the most advanced version I've ever seen in my life? No, no, Mr. Konka knows he can't button the way. Remember the last time he tried doing that? How yeah. much he got punished? He got punished so hard he brought Fox out. You know, that's bad. All right, we went 20 seconds into the match without them hitting, without them hitting each other. Oh, but they finally got it Here out. Here we go. He knows, Mr. Konka knows he has to go for those high chase downs and try to get those edge guards. That's what he really needs. Cause right. I mean, it's, it's a weakness. He's definitely got to take his opportunities when they come because they're not going to come often if, uh, you know, if Nitro has his way with the match. And I like this pace change we're seeing from the Kong Kong. Definitely respect the record. He definitely didn't do that last game. Yeah. The last time they opened up, uh, he played the set. Yeah, he kind of held forward the last game and just hoped for the best. This time he's a little more calculated approach. Uh, that's, that was a bad cycle and got caught on the platform. Unfortunately, he, I think he tried to pull off a great beat reversal. He's going to move on forward. He's got to deal with that cross. It's this really difficult matchup. And he's actually throwing fireballs of his own to try to, you know, get through. And he's trying to block, you know, kind of the football mentality. If you get some good blocking going on, you might be able to open him up on the inside. Right into a great air dodge, but a great up smash to follow up, and no, he's dead. Wow, that killed. <laughs> That's surprising. Even, There's no even, red flash or anything. Yeah, it wasn't even the sweet spot, too. Like, I, I think uh, Mr. Konkon might have been caught with the Brawl DI holding up on this control stick <laughs> and got a little bit of, uh, you know, uh, I mean, Knockback boost. He's doing a little better in Brawl because at least Richter has got that game. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, but then you got to deal with that Olimar with his what? Eight Pikmin? Six. Six. It's still bad though. Yeah. All right, but doing the best as he can. He finally matched him with the dash attack. Right now, this is the scenario he wants. Forcing Nitro into these bad situations. Oh, uh, he picked him up with something like a dash attack or a down tilt or something. And Nitro dropping the stock. Well, it was once a massive lead. Oh, no, it's still a massive oh, lead. Good combo. Down. Little one, little ones and twos. He's still going to jump, though, so he's going to use that. Side. Where is that? Yeah, I don't know what just happened. Right Where'd there. it go? <laughs> How did he do that? That's a thing, right? That one's <laughs> is that, flying is that a glitch? Away, yeah. Sakurai, what happened? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> All right, we're still moving through. We're doing the best as we can right now. He's trying to escape from this bad situation. Uh, I thought we were getting interrupted by the uh, commissioner himself. I was, uh, you know, uh, waving our direction, but back to the match and losers finals. <laughs> I mean, that feels good right now. He's able to get these chains right now. That jab going to catch him out as well. And able to punish that downer on shield too. That'll be critical, you know. Here we go. Uh, Trying to pick up the platform roll, but Nitro wisely rolling away. And also in these scenarios, he almost got that. That would have been so good, but he's actually able to air dodge in a different direction right now. He's running to use his fireballs, but the back air finally catches him out. Oh my god, oh, the, the axe disappeared. I was like, oh, he's in trouble. And this time Nitro realizes he's going for the roll. He was catching up. Yeah, some, okay, some a big hidden, the jump. It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a thing. Richter has uh, some hidden technology throwing the holy water really far. There's the missile, able to get back. He's uh, Lux knew that I was having my <laughs> mouth wide open. For but is this going to be it? He's actually unable to get it, but he finally catches back on. But it wasn't and even he, the he fire. Yeah, he doesn't get the fire. It's just the bottle the bottle combos. Yo, you remember down special into it. So from, yeah, I got yeah. you, man. It's just smack the ball right in his face and gets it. But anything works out right now. And Mr. Konkon with this if that was a misfire, that, that, that would have been, been hilarious. But uh, yeah, he, that was probably nice an axe issue. Good edge guard. from... Mr. Con Con, he needs to get these off. If he's yeah. able to get those earlier, then it could potentially roll over into the next game, but that tornado definitely trades, which is really good. He's done a good job battling himself into the match. Yeah, he was so far behind. Oh, here we go. Here we go. He Let's needs see. To get this he dropped it. Out. No. <laughs> All right. It's a uh, uh, you know, sigh of relief from Nitro. He's still in it. It could oh. be worse. Oh, that was an opportunity, too. A super jump punch ready and on deck, but he's going to get crushed by the fire. Oh, that could have been it. Oh, uh, and he down tilts it out of there, you know, just doesn't want to risk the uh, That's situation. It. Oh, he's able to get he back. He thought he oh, was dead. Bad he thought he was dead. He thought he was dead. And another SD comes and claims us, uh, you know, claims Mr. Concon now. And. Lux, he <laughs> thought he was dead. That was great attentive play. Like, make yeah. sure he doesn't get the coin part, but. Not enough to recover. Yeah. yeah, a little frustration on Mr. Conkon. He battled back so far, only to come up just a little bit short. But no time, no rest for the weary. 
We're coming into game two, and they're opening up. Mr. Conkunst really just got to shake it off and move on to the next set because here it comes. One, two, three. Javi, you oh. got to move the camera, my guy. No worries. You know, <laughs> I, I can feel them. You see their focus face. You know, they got the game faces on. They're taking it seriously. That's been confirmed by the player cam, but we're opening up. We got full screen now. Welcome to full screen mode engaged. Con Con doing a good job going out after my respectful oh play. That could have been so bad if you actually just get hit by something, but these tilt attacks are coming in clutch. You can't stop that fire with your own cycle. Oh, yeah, I'm going to pick up the forge smash. You probably just need to charge it just a little bit. Yeah, yeah. and here comes the dash attack. He needs to get these edge guard right now. Oh, no, and he died, and there's another SD. It's that that old adage, only those who go too far know truly know how far they can go, and... Uh, Mr. Concon learning the limits of Luigi the hard way here in the finals. It's just painful to watch. You, you, you can see me like literally <laughs> pain. See this happen because he's getting it down. He's getting these like potential grabs for his that play. He just can't execute. It's such a high pressure situation that you're putting yourself in. And one, two, three, once again, but he can't get the fair. Yeah, he's, you know, he saw a little a bit of hesitation on his part there. Like maybe he shouldn't be going out that far. And you can't get in your head. You know, you got, if you're committing to the game plan of going after them off stage, you just got to go. Don't question it. Oh, no, there's another SD. And yeah, the wheels are kind of coming off. Oh, my god. My chest is tightening. Yeah. Oh, uh, there's another air dodge, but he's able to survive that time. That would have been a super heartbreaker. He might have just left the building at that point. Oh, my god. And Nitro just laying it on now. That's the hard part if you have an opponent that just you know chokes the life out of you. They feel that momentum. They feel you tightening up because you made a couple of mistakes. And it feels horrible, but right. remember, he's still got one more game at least after right. this one. Yeah, maybe take a little bit of information, see if you can't break through the wall. That's going to be a tall order. It could have been a bigger punish. Yeah. It's starting to get into his head right now. It's slipping away from Mr. Concon. Oh, he's trying to use the tornado to be safe, and he can't do that. My God, ooh, he gets back on with the misfire into the down switch, but he's still alive. He comes rocketing back down. Oh, and <laughs> Richter survived. That whole entire exchange, so, you know, even a misfire, not enough to save Mr. Kong Kong so far this time. Goes for the down smash, doesn't quite pick it up. It was just enough shield push back to avoid the grab, the F to force him off stage. He's going, oh, <laughs> YOLO, baby, let's go. If you're going down, you <laughs> might as well do it in style. Oh, my God, it gets a side special, but uh, it's still a painful game. Yeah. No worries, you know, as I said, he's got another game to work with. Mm -hmm. And, you know, for all we know, maybe a zero to death. Maybe two? He got, he's got. he got to land these, though. The window is open. Nah, maybe not so much anymore. Yeah. <laughs> all right, he's hit himself out of the win condition, but it's all right, just taking on some data. Now, here's the hard part. In order to get past zoners, you got to be able to make some reads, and you got to do that through conditioning. To get through three games against the zoner is difficult because you got to burn your reads, and at some point, Nigel's a good player. He's going to adapt to it. I'm wondering if we might see a situation if KonKon wins game three. You know, Nitro just makes the adaptation game for and closes the door. Yeah, we'll see this works out. Great use of the Zare, 19%. And a good, yeah, good fireball. fireball. Oh, this, there we go. This is still possible. It's still, it's within the reason. Yeah. I, if I, man, if I were Nitro, I'd just stand on the platform and make Mr. Concon just uh, yes. hit me with a couple aerials. Yeah. And, and then not, you know, and just play, play right of it. I, I play this old school. Yeah, take the damage. All right, now play the game. He needs to get this clutch right now. This will be so huge for him. He went for the dash attack, but couldn't get it down. He knows those back are coming. He needs to find some way around it. The grab should be able to kill him, though. Not that enough. could have been the up throw. That would have ended the stock. Maybe he's playing a nice and easy figure as he can get one more grab. There's oh, a tilt. Right There's oh, a kill. God. Yeah, Nitro. Minimize, you know, you can feel containing it. He, you, can you can see him tightening up a little bit, too. Now both players are super tight. Everybody's SD in left and right, and we are in losers finals. You know it's getting late or early, depending on uh, how you look at it. Yeah, Depends players. what time zone you're in. <laughs> yeah, time, you know, time. Uh, yeah, we are in a land devoid of time, but we are. But you can definitely feel just every hit tightens you up just a little bit, getting a little bit nervous. All right, here we go. Game three. Back to Battlefield one more time, Mr. Concon. You know, not going to rely on the stages to help him out. Oh, no, he went the wrong direction. He's going to be all right. Okay. Yeah, you don't want to be on the ledge versus uh, the right Belmonts, but yeah. it's better than losing the stock. Here we go. Here we go. Need to get Statement. this. Oh, he missed it. He missed but it. But he still gets 62%, so at least he's got that. Could be right. much, much worse. 75 now. Good advantage situation. Picking up more damage, even. And again, 100 damage. And he still got him in a juggle and gets the back air. Didn't pick up the roll, the roll back. 
and we're right back into neutral. But good exchange overall for Mr. Konkai. And he picks up a forward air for his trouble and has him off stage. Here we go. Yeah, and the coin actually gives him out the side special yeah. was buffered. Oh my goodness, Mr. Konkai, that's huge for him. He needs to roll with this momentum. Yeah, and that whole entire time he was playing that entire stock practically in advantage situation. If he can control the pacing and play an advantage. That's his recipe for victory. Just easier said than done because Nitro is so slippery and so you know hard to get into a disadvantage state. But it's still a win condition. Yeah, he's still focus but he's got to do it. You know, there's no other way. There's, there's that's that's just it. Uh, and hits him with the jab. Here it comes. He's gonna look for the get up option. He catches him with another jab once more. Doing a good job, bullying oh him. Oh my God! This Forces is an SD, and here we go, what Mr. Kong Kong. What is happening? <laughs> Mr. Kong Kong just you know, as I said. He's picked up his reads, did some conditioning in game two to set up game three. Let's this see. Is, this is literally the definition of Bunkus, like, <laughs> at this point. Like, and I'll also, like to say the adaptation, Mr. Konkon is using Tornado a lot more than right. he But the Not, problem But now he's back to getting hit by a projectile, so, you know. <laughs> yeah, the problem is, though, is that you said, remember, if you even win game three, yeah. you're exhausting all your reads right now. Right. But, you know, you also can't read, really read an SD. So right. So it kind of works in his favor, and he's actually going right now, 70% already. Stop it, Mr. Konkon. Yeah, he stepped out a lot of jump options, doing a really good job. And, uh, oh, there's Tornado. Yeah, Nitro not even really able to battle right through it. You know, at some point he's going to bait it out, but until that day, Konkon's just going to throw it out. No problem. He DI'd up. Excellent job by Mr. Konkon, avoiding death by the skin of his teeth. He's getting away from the end of great air dodge to avoid the axe. He dodges the Elp Smash Nitro. It's and forcing all kinds of weird recovery patterns from Nitro. Here we go, gets the dash attack. That could have been a jab lock. That would have been even better, but unable to find out what the tornado surely does find its mark. Mr. Konkon needs to find the edge guard right now, and he actually doesn't get it, but that vertical recovery coming in and clutch. Ah, you There's finally the back here, But down. a very good stock coming out from Mr. Konkon in the early goings of game three. Or late going, it's practically over, but. Uh, you never know. You remember last time Mr. Kong <laughs> Oh, yeah. Really last close. time we were talking about, like, the set's already over, and Mr. Kong was like, I have a thing or two to say about it. Uh -huh. But so if you think about it, this has been kind of a continuation of that game, you know, like, just in terms of the momentum and the pressure. It's so. a <laughs> Hit him up with that one, and here comes the fireball up. Destiny, he needs to get the edge guard perfectly done, uses the credit card yeah. swipe, hits him with the. Boy. Gives him the handshake off stage, yeah. and there we go. Picks up a game. And this is where, this is trouble, like, so this is, like, the test. Uh -huh. Does Mr. Konkon have a read on the situation? Or, or does Nitro adapt fast? Or does, yeah, does do Nitro it. adapt fast? Because I imagine, you know, you don't ever want to call it for sure, but if if Mr. Konkon wins this game, it'll kind of confirm and put Nitro on tilt that he has control of the situation. But on the flip side, you know, Nitro just wants to end it right here and right now. Does not want to see a game five. Let's go game four. He wants four. a rematch. Yeah, he wants to get that rematch, get that run back with uh, T3 Dome waiting in grand finals. One, go. And here we go. All right, they're opening up on FD, removing the platforms. And that's another thing to factor in. They played every single game on Battlefield. And the platforms, you know, trying to be used by Mr. Konkon to his advantage. Nitro just wants to open up the game, remove the platforms, have the projectiles, you know, come out and make Mr. Konkon really have to make some plays in order to get him, you know, get him off stage. It's going to be harder to maneuver around, but remember, it also gives less options for Nitro to recover. But great axe, my goodness, 99% already. He's got the Zare that covered his option perfectly timed. So he's got him off the edge. Great use of Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. It was the right option with Cyclone. It was it too just, late, though. Yeah, the hit just didn't hit, and here we go. He's able to get away with the ship and the shield, getting ready for that jump. Oh my god, that is a well, that is not a well-placed tilt attack, but he's Fireball. out of it. Fireball is coming in clutch for Mr. Konkon. Air dodge off stage, but he's back. He's trying to find some way out of it. He's trying to use these stairs. And he's trying to find some way in. The cycle didn't come in time. But the cross is actually going to catapult him right back onto the stage. But yeah, maybe a God. questionable air dodge. Oh, questionable recovery that time. And again, another SD. That's uh, Where's the SD counter chat? I think we're at like 17 on the night or something insane. <laughs> it's going to be so good that Zare into dash attack is really good confirm. He needs to get it. He needs oh, to he get those that edge guards. Air. Yeah, that, that's unfortunate. Did Dallas Bars actually hit twice? Yeah, on the shield, yeah. Front side and back side. Almost popped it. But not enough, not enough damage. Still got like 5 to percent to work with. Can't get gipped out by that one. He needs to find some way. And he's going for the hard read, but the F smash is sure to punish that attempt. He the axe to the face. Luigi struggles to recover, especially against Simon and Richter in the two dynamic duo. But a great tech from Nitro. He's staying alive and yeah. hits him with the back air. Is this reversal? He does get it. Nitro is on fire right now. And 
Final destination, helping out. Some good plays coming out from Nitro. But there There's the edge guard. That's what he needed. All right. So Mr. Concon, don't count him out. He's got a puncher's chance. Got to play that win condition. And there's no platforms to run away from him. So he's got to, you know, if he can break the zone, he's in business. But he hasn't hit one all night. That's the hard part, you know. You go all night without hitting a uh, zero to death. And want to pull one out on your last stock. Yep, and this is constant game of chicken about who's going to catch these projectiles, who's going to get hit by up right there. But he's going to try to find his way back in. Finally, a backer force him off stage. But my goodness, what do we see in the option? The tournament grab. Go. He needs to get. He did this. not connect. There's a footstool out, and that's the heartbreaker. That was his uh, opportunity to really close it out, but it's unfortunate because he wants to pick up that landing up here, but he just does not get it. It's just not working out for him. He's practiced it. He's lobbed it so many times, but he's unable to get it. That Cyclone finally catches it out, but my goodness, he just needs to get something down fast because he's got clutch factor. He's done it before. Right. He's doing it now, a little bit right now. He's just blowing uh, Nitro off stage. He's slowly whittling away at it. Here comes the re-grab. He's not able to read the option. He goes for the hard read with the F-Smash, but it's not going to actually reach. The up smash, I mean, but my goodness, he's looking so close. That fire is going to hit him, but the axe surely won't. He actually uses the Cyclone to get past the air dodge as well. Mr. Konkon is trying to find any way to get him, but the up the shield is not going to kill just yet. Holding on for dear life, he's on the edge, and that'll forward tilt. Yeah, that'll take it. So Mr. Konkon finally getting eliminated, but my god. That was a very hard set. To yeah, val yeah, valiant effort, but sometimes, you know, just a little bit short from recovering. Too many SDs, and I guess especially against a player of Nitro's caliber, it's tough. And also, uh, lack of zero for that, for sure. Yeah, he dropped, dropped a couple key critical moments. You know, but that, that's that's the blessing and the curse. When things go wrong, and you go back and you watch the sets, and you have to listen to Lux's terrible commentary while you're reviewing your sets, oh, just take a, little, take a little bit of solace that, you know, you kind of have a clear roadmap on things that you could fix in order to 